Video shows the moments leading up to a gun battle that killed Atlanta rapper Bankroll Fresh outside a Northwest Atlanta recording studio. Tonight, Atlanta police searching for persons of interest. Fox 5's Nathalie Pozo live at Atlanta Police Headquarters. And Nathalie, police now say this may have been a case of self-defense. Well, Russ and a, determining who started this gunfight has been a challenge for the Atlanta Police Department and also the DA's office. They're hoping by releasing this video tonight, it will help them identify other people who were present at the time of this gun battle and determine if this is a self-defense case. Atlanta police releasing this new video to Fox 5. Investigators say this is just a seconds before local rapper Trantavius White, known as Bankroll Fresh, was shot and killed last March outside the street execs recording studio. When people shoot at each other, somebody is defending themselves. It's just a matter of who. Atlanta police say this is Bankroll Fresh with an AK-47, and it shows others surrounding him with guns drawn. The video is too graphic to show in its entirety, but police say people in the car across the street and Bankroll Fresh both were firing at each other. At some point, uh, you know, if you if you shoot at someone and they shoot back, then of course they're defending themselves. But determining that has, like I said, has been a challenge for us because we do have. Uh, different stories depending on who you talk to. Police say they've received conflicting statements and hope to talk to others to figure out what led to this gunfight and who was the primary aggressor. What we'd like to see now is anyone who who might know more than what we found out from from the witnesses that we've already spoken to. If someone has something further to add that will corroborate, corroborate hopefully what we know or even tell us something else that we don't know. Police tell me they do know the people who were inside of that car across the street, but have not made any arrests nearly a year later because, again, they have not been able to determine if this was self defense. If you have any information on the people seen in that video, you can call the Atlanta Police Department or Crime Stoppers. Reporting live tonight at Atlanta Police Headquarters, Nathalie Pozo, Fox 5 News. All right, thank you, Nathalie.